Our first glimpse of the ocean! Up close. Since we left home. Since we left home. <laughs> <laughs> it hasn't been too long a day of driving. We're um, we're at Neisner. We've arrived in Neisner. Weather forecast for Neisner and Plettenberg Bay, which is our next destination after this, for the next two days is stormy, and rainy, and windy. What was the what was the swell forecast at um, at Vic Bay today? It was like I think that was ocean open ocean swell though, uh, but it was like 12 to 22 foot, very which wide range. Big. But yeah, it's massive. Um, so I might have to revise our plan as one does on the road. Um, and yeah, it could be quite cool to maybe go to the nice heads and get some stormy, Definitely. big swell rolling in the heads are beautiful, especially on a good day. But it could be um, interesting on quite a moody day. And yeah, we'll see. We'll, we always get up to something fun. Yeah, if um, if it's just a light drizzle or whatever, we can go to the nice and forests. You're generally pretty protected under the canopy there. Yeah. Um, if it's not as bad as they say, we must definitely try go for a snorkel tomorrow morning at the heads. Yeah. Um, yeah. Let's let's see what the weather holds tomorrow morning. everyone and welcome to a very very rainy and stormy Neisner last night a massive storm pulled through bucketing with rain crazy wind um, I see some of the furniture and the pot plants outside have kind of uh, redistributed themselves and fallen over um, but yeah we are packed up it was obviously a quick one night stay in our little um, accommodation here in Leisure Isle and we're just gonna cruise around the island. There's lots of cool photo opportunities. Um, and I don't know, sometimes it's quite cool to capture the stormy weather outside. Also the swell prediction for today, I think is pretty wildly massive. So we're gonna head up to a spot in Neisner called The Heads, which is where the ocean enters the lagoon. Um, very picturesque. And I think we should be in for some wild seas. <laughs> <laughs> what are you working so studiously on? Just taking care of business, man. Good, good. Been on this phone non-stop for the last 40 minutes. As the one phone call ends, the next one begins. But that's just that's a day in the life of me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> cool, man. <laughs> This is, uh, this is dedication to get the shot. It's bloody freezing out here. 
pouring with rain. And <laughs> Nick's just out the vehicle trying to get the, the shots of the car driving around the, the bend with the nice knives and the heads in the back. I've got the seat warmers on at least, so when she hops back in, the, her seat will be nice and toasty. Oh my gosh, it's freezing. <laughs> I'm toasty, yeah, I've got the heater on. shooting obviously had like my tripod my camera lots of metal stuff um, I was trying to shoot some birds in the rain and I just like saw this bright flash like in front of me and I looked up because there was a car coming so I thought it was flashing me for some reason and then heard the thunder rumbling in the background um, so I almost died you almost died and then your your camera and then I panicked because I didn't yeah. want to hold up my tripod or my camera. So I tried to set my tripod down and like get away I from don't it. Think you tried to set it. You literally just well, yeah. left it and the whole thing was started like teetering toppling. down with a big zoom lens in the front. I was like, no, I'd rather risk getting uh, struck by lightning than yeah, that was good my equipment. Good reflexes to catch it again. But yeah, um, down with shooting in the rain, sopping. It's not fun. Gone. Well, that sucked. <laughs> um, you guys would have seen the clip, but yeah, lost my brand new reading glasses <laughs> that I got from Glasses USA, and I literally I wear those things absolutely everywhere. What happened? <laughs> I don't know. It was firstly like this, like this blast or whirl came through. And as I pushed them to sit on my head, the gust got them. <laughs> yes, they just went flying. And all flying. I saw, I just looked behind me and I just saw them whirling in the air. But the part, we spent like half an hour trying to look for them. There's so much thick vegetation there. Also, they're so light and the wind was just, it's chaos out there. So it could have gone stuck in any number of trees or in underneath the grasses. I think we kind of come back through Nisna tomorrow. Um, hopefully if it's not windy, we can stop in here and give it another another yeah. look i mean i think it's a needle in a haystack a and very a very expensive needle in a haystack yeah. um but anyways that sucks these are my only so those obviously had prescription these also have prescription in so <laughs> so you're gonna <laughs> be re to you're gonna be doing your emails now <laughs> your, i don't need them for reading you look like uh you look like ray charles <laughs> <laughs> anyways 
Let's hit the road. Okay. I'm cold and wet Plan? and a bit miserable. Yeah, we've done it. We've finished with shooting today. It's terrible weather. We're freezing. We're heading on to Plentimo Bay, another incredibly beautiful coastal place, just half an hour away. Nice sunny beaches and beautiful <sighs> Usually it locations. is beautiful sunny beaches, but um, yeah, so we'll be driving there and we'll keep you guys posted along the way. Thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video and for those of you who aren't sure what Squarespace is or what they do, they are basically an all-in-one platform to build a beautiful and powerful website. Squarespace already has all of the tools in place that makes customizing a website to what you want super, super simple. This includes pre-designed templates, so you simply pick something that you like or you think will work with what you want to create and you're able to customize it from there. Apart from giving you access to your website analytics, which is one of the most vital tools that you can harness if you're wanting to grow and upscale your business, Squarespace have also introduced some new, really great marketing tools. From SEO and social to email marketing with Squarespace email campaigns, this will allow you to reach and grow new audiences. If this sounds like it might work for you, or if you wanted to start that blog eventually, go to squarespace.com for a free trial. And once you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com forward slash Nicole Eddy for 10% off of your first purchase of a domain or website. Thanks, guys, and I'll see you soon.